Hey guys, Ricardo here and welcome to another Blog Tech Tips. In today's tutorial guys, I'm going to show you to browse the internet on your TCL Google TV. Now of course, to browse the internet is quite simple. You just need your remote. And of course, you're going to scroll all the way down. You should see the option down here to browse the internet. If not, you can always go to apps and you can search here for a web browser that you're more familiar with. But I'm just going to show you how to do this using the basics on the TV so let's use the built-in browser this is a TCL Google TV so just simply search for this icon for right out of the box browsing top and of course um, it might require that you install as we said you can install some other browser such as Chrome it could be anything so this is called TV web browser and of course you can browse it shows you the ratings um, you can use your own, as I said, such as um, Chrome. Alright, so we're going to install this one. Now, there are others that might work. Some TVs might not allow like Chrome because of the TV itself, like the TCL TV. But of course, um, it's always best to go with the one that the TV recommends. And then after, you can try to find some additional ones. If Chrome doesn't work, you can try uh, Firefox. If Firefox doesn't work, you can try something else. So I'm using this one because it's recommended, meaning it will most likely work. But of course, um, as we said before, you should be able to browse. So I'm going to come back when this is finished. All right, it's finished. And the reason why we chose this browser again, as you can see there, um, it is a TCL browser. So go ahead, open. All right, so as you can see here again, um, it's basically to show you to get started. I'm just going to get started. All right, so you get the idea here. So check it out. It has everything. You can search Google. You can go and you can go to YouTube. And of course, as we said, it's the default browser for your device. Check it out, guys. So everything is here accordingly. So you can um, browse through content. All right. And all right, so we have several quick apps over here. History and so on. And we have... The typical stuff down here but of course if you have a specific website you can actually browse it here so if you want to just simply search for the name of the website and it will take you there I'm gonna try a quick one for example guys I've searched for my website and of course I'm gonna select it here's the on-screen browser interface is very cool there you go. So this is my website. And of course, as you can see, Blog Tech Tips is up. So the browser, the browser does um, actually work. All right. So definitely use the, let me go back home. So definitely use the built-in browser. It's recommended. And of course, you might be able to find other browsers that works as well. All right. So I'm going to end this tutorial here. Um, if you have any questions, please ask them below. And as always, Ricardo from Blog Tech Tips. Same bye until next time. Bye.